¿Quién eres? Ya le va a cargar la verga a tu familia. Jesus, he wasn't a threat, you know. We're all clear. Heads up, hostile presence. Heads up. We've got Unidad patrols in the area. Probably response to all the shit we've been stirring here in Okoro. There's another one. That's ten. I got a target carrying submachine guns. We're up to fifteen. I got eyes on a sniper. Marking an enemy. That's twenty guys. Target spotted. Sniper out there. I got eyes on a sniper. to the rebels for some reinforcements. Sniper up there. Down, you're giving yourself away.
Rally on me. Moving. Hold your position. I copy. All clear. Sniper, top of the tower. Big world clear now. Look alive, we got company. Sicario over here, next to the container, see? Clear over here.
bad guys. Just missed him. He's looking for the source. Uno down in the cartel will go now. Keep it quiet. Copy. Engaging. Uno down troops are moving in. Enemy down. Fire. I copy. Roger. I copy. Move there. Copy that. No Target's marked. Standing by for go order. Engaging. Frag out. Get some. Shots fired. He dad's engaging the cartel. That guy's history. Surprise, dickheads. We're not there anymore. Shit, we've got cartel soldiers inbound. Ready? Fire, fire, fire. Copy that.
Damn, that was close. We got a man down, so can still go. Good shooting. Let's clean up and move on. Hang tight. Coming up on the target area now. Get ready. Bowman can't wait to take a run at El Amasario. So watch your fire. We need to take him alive. Copy that. I need you there. Roger that. Ready? Open fire. Copy. I have a shot. Engaging. We got more Sicarios incoming. I'll be damned. Tango ladies and gentlemen, El Emisario has left the building. Killed himself rather than face his own grandfather. That's fucked up. I feel like we drove him to it. Come on, man, stop it with that shit. He made a choice. We need to check the body. See if he's got anything on him. Hey, got a suicide note. Bowman, this is Nomad. We found El Emisario. He's dead. What happened? He killed himself. Left a note to El Sueño taking the blame for the loss of the labs in Okoro. Guess the shame of failing his grandfather was just too much to take. That little shit. We had El Yeyo by the nuts, and now this. Guess he wasn't quite the fuck up we thought he was. He just didn't break the way we expected him to. It happens sometimes. Well, you do this sort of thing a lot? I do whatever it takes to get the job done. Same as you. Innovation versus experience. Technology versus tradition. Youth versus age. La Gringa versus El Yayo. I had been hoping they would complement each other, but they could not get along. They were too different. I have been producing cocaine this way for years. That's exactly the problem. Our product was so good, the demand was only increasing. We couldn't keep up. I don't care how you do it. Science, tradition, or voodoo. Just make more. Or I'll find someone that can. The Santa Blanca cocaine production pipeline, led by El Yayo. It all starts in the fields with the harvesting of the Erythroxlum novogranitens, aka the coca plant. Of the 200 known species of Erythroxlum, only two contain usable levels of cocaine, so you have to know what you're planting. El Yayo knows what he's planting. First, his people strip the leaves off the plant. Then the leaves are dried, finely chopped, and sent to the lab. That's where this chick comes in. The gringa here is an American chemist with Mensa level IQ and sub-zero morality numbers. They take the chopped leaves, dust them with lime, that's right, lime, then pour diesel fuel all over them. Stir for three days. You can use a washing machine or a cement mixer, but Santa Blanca does it by hand. Then they mix all this shit with sulfuric acid, a dash of caustic soda, and bam. Cocaine paste. You dry it, chuck in more acid, and pretty soon you got powder. But now you have to purify it because no one wants to snort yellow powder. It's gross. So, a little more acid, some potassium permanganate, pyrolusite, hungry yet? Filter it with ammonia and beautiful, pure white cocaine. But everyone knows how to do this, right? What makes Santa Blanca so special? What makes SB a brand? because they figured it out. How to mass produce a custom product, plant genetics, logistics, mechanization, state-of-the-art labs, reduction of redundancies, quality control, purity of chemicals, and of course, the secret sauce. They're geniuses. They've taken Coke production into the 22nd century. What Henry Ford did for the factory, they've done for the lab. They're innovators, they're pioneers, they're SB.